Hello and welcome back to my Sims 3 Let's Play. My name is Kimberly, also known as Sock Bunny, and I'm recording in sunny Florida in the United States of America. And this is my Roaring Ambitions, Roaring Heights Ambitions Let's Play. Um, I decided to have her do a bunch of scans at home just to get her job experience up. Uh, I think it's working at home. Let me see. Yep. So I'm just having her practice scanning is what I'm saying in my mind. <laughs> just to get her uh, skill up. Let's see, he's still sleeping. He's going to be getting up soon. He really is close to getting his um, skill level up. So I'm going to have him, when he gets done, come down and... Uh, let's see. I'll just go ahead and take this and put it in his inventory. I'll have him come research some fashion. That should get his job up. So, yeah, it's going up slowly but surely. I'll have her come up and work on logic also. How, what is her logic skill right now? It is currently a level 7. It's leisure day, so we, they can pretty much do whatever they want today. No, we're not going to have a pool party. He's still sleeping. He's going to need to eat. Actually, let's have him when he gets up. What time is it? Uh, it's only 5.15. When he gets up, I'll have him go look for um, bugs. A moth in particular. Let's see you. Come and eat some leftovers. Uh, grapes pancakes. Sounds good. And then you can come take care of yourself. I never did put the bubble bath stuff in there, did I? Yeah, I did. Did she have the option? Yeah, okay, I just didn't see it. Alright, so you can do that, um, and then I'll let you go to sleep. She's on a completely different schedule than everybody else because she uh, is a ghost hunter at night. So he should be super, super f fast bringing this up. And then he needs to finish working out to uh, get his workout reward here. So let's have him do that when he gets done. Because that's any second now. What are you doing? Grabbing something to eat. Okay. And is your homework done? I think so, but let's check. Yep, it's done. Okay. So at about 7 o'clock, I'll have him check and see if there are any moths out there. We could speed this up a little bit. Are you still sleeping? Yeah. When you get done, I'm going to have you use this. And then you need some sort of human interaction. I guess you could... No, you're not going to a pool party for sure. You could call your quote-unquote girlfriend <laughs> and uh, chat with her for human interaction. That should work. How's it going? Did you get it yet? Almost. So close. Oh, you're going to eat in between? That's what you think. <laughs> You're not going to die. Okay, so she's taking her bubble bath. No, we're not going to throw a pool party. We don't have a pool. I mean, I know you could have it at a public lot if you want to, but... Finish a book? Sure. No, you're not having a water balloon fight. Oh, wait. No, I thought I was clicked on Moses. Get a part-time job. Uh, No, that's okay. Moses, how are you? And then you probably should eat some scraps. I think it's funny he can wash his hands. That doesn't hurt him. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm calling you from the bathroom. How are you doing? Nope, she can't talk. Why did all your things go away? Did he eat those that fast? Oh, I guess he did. Uh, let's see. Nope, nope, nope. Let's call her again. Chat. And you didn't do what I told you, did you? No. Alright. Come in here, do this. Oh, David just did a painting. Alright. Let's go upstairs. Finish this take my eyes off of you for two seconds and you just do whatever you feel like. Okay, could you go to a different room and have your conversation? She's trying to sleep. 
Oh, you silly robot. Yeah, could you go find something else to do? Come, um, actually, you know what? Stay up there. Come work on your writing skill. Come, let's start a book. Let's see. <laughs> writing. Let's start a sci-fi novel. Uh, what? Uh, did I tell you to sit down there? No, I didn't. Get up and go here. No. Get up. Okay. You doing it? Yes. Warp factor infinity. How about life with humanoids? Okay. You could go fishing, I guess. Make the bed. You're probably going to do that anyway. Actually, you could come out here and catch fish real quick. So you can get that other thing. And then we will go look while you're fishing, we'll go look for a moth. Oh, is that the moth? Yes. Where are you, mothy poo? I think I see it. Whoop. Whoop. These trees. Okay, good. Alright, so when he catches a fish... Well, when he catches five fish, he'll stop. If he catches that many. It's a lovely day for a festival. Uh, I don't think I put a festival lot in this neighborhood, did I? Let me look again. I don't think I did. Pretty sure I did not. Yeah, that's okay. We don't need to go to the spring festival or, yeah, summer festival. Okay, so he's working on his writing skill. Did you catch a fish yet? Not yet. Keep working on it. Oh, come on. There we go. beautiful. It's pretty realistic looking, actually. have to say. Wow, today's going by fast. It's already 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, no wonder I'm on double speed. <laughs> okay, so you are working on that. Dude, could you please come do what I want you to do? Okay, take this. Where's your job level? You're so close. Could you please just do this? Come work out real quick. Moses has been invited to a party. No, we're not going to go. He's busy. And you are just going to sleep the whole day away. So when you wake up, I'm going to have you come practice your chess. Write a novel? No. Could ask your husband for a makeover. Have you caught a fish? Any fish? Yes, you have a fish. So you could, I think. Oh, I did buy a couple of, um. What? You can get there. Yeah, sit there. Um, I did buy a couple of, uh, uh lifetime half name. <laughs> Lifetime Happiness Rewards. I got her the prof Professional Simoleon Booster, which means she gets more money for every professional job she completes. Not that we think she's going to do that many more. And um, him, I got him. Who did I get it for? I got somebody, I thought. Oh, I got him the map to the stars. And that way, oh, we already had it? I'll just give it to, oops, we'll give it to our son then. I can't believe I bought that twice. Actually, we'll give it to Moses. Um, so that he's going to use the map to the stars to try to find some celebrities to do makeovers on. As soon as he gets this, 
completed. All right. So you actually can go deliver a fish. And then you're also going to be able to deliver the uh, butterflies. So that gives you something to do. Because you'll be at the same spot anyway. So that was perfect timing. Oh, you need to go potty. Use that. And then we'll have you eat a few... Oh, I always click on the wrong thing. A few scraps. And then you can get back over here and work on your book. Writing. Continue writing Life with Humanoids. Did you get your workout done? Did he have more than one of the uh, workout things? Okay, workout for 30 minutes. I thought he had a different one for four hours. <sighs> oh, he probably just already got it. Let's see. Okay, so his school performance increased. Okay, yeah, he did do that other one. He's got 250 celebrity points for doing that. She doesn't have any? Yeah. She wants to buy a motorcycle? <laughs> no. Swim in the ocean? No. You could ask him for a makeover. Uh, did he get this one yet? Okay, whoops, nope. Stay, turn in those items. That's your school. Okay. And now he's going to get all these wishes about... Okay, so sometime this weekend he needs to learn how to drive. Okay, you stop. You stop. I want you to ask him for a makeover. No. Okay, I want you to offer her a makeover. Fashion. Offer makeover. Okay. Because her wish is to get a makeover. Get a makeover at the salon. I wonder if this will count. Since it's not at the salon. If it doesn't count, <laughs> if it doesn't count, uh, then we will uh, take her over there. This should work though. I think I'll just change her hairstyle. I'm not going to do like a major overhaul. You do need a new hairstyle. You've had this one for a long time. She is really pretty. How about this one, Esther? <laughs> Actually, that doesn't look too bad on her. She's got a really pretty face. Wow, okay, no. Yeah, one well, that will show up your face would be a good idea. That looks pretty. I could give you one of the styles that matches the town that we live in. Uh, that one actually looks pretty on her. Should we do a different color? <gasps> Ooh. Should we? Or just go brown. Let's just go brown. That's good enough. We still want to be able to recognize her, right? <laughs> okay, let's see if that counts. If not, then we'll have to take her over to the salon. No? Yes? Well, that helped. That pushed him over the edge anyway to get to level 8. Okay. How tired are you? Okay, so I'm going to have him come down and swim in the ocean because it did not recognize that he was working out for 30 minutes. So let's come do this. Come swim. 
And now he has all these fish wishes, which I don't want. Okay, she's going to get something to eat. Are you still working on your book? Yes, alright. So I guess that didn't count for her. Yeah, it did, actually. Yeah, it counted. Swim in the ocean. You want to swim in the ocean, too? Alright, come swim in the ocean. You can eat when you're done. Okay, he got $292. Okay, Sean is hot, hot shot. And he makes 964 or 984. I can't see that. It's pretty far away. 984 per week. Okay, good. Okay, you are still working on this, and all your needs are pretty good. You are going to need to go to bed, though, after a while. Here's... Are you going to... Did that not... No, get up here. Go swimming. Go swimming. I don't care. You're in the water. It does not matter what your hygiene is. <laughs> Okay, I'm looking at this. It's 10.50-ish. Okay, we'll say 11. You need to swim until 11.30. Swim here. Swim here. Stay in the water till 11.30. I'm going to make this faster. Swim here. Stay in the water till 11.30, and then you should have this. Okay, see, this is not registering that he's working out. So, what are we going to do? We are going to get rid of that one. Okay, go home. Just having a piece of cake. Okay, so when you get done, I'm going to have you use the bathroom. And then we're just going to scan for spirits a bunch of times. funny if she found one, right? Okay, so just practice that. You should probably go ahead and stop and take care of yourself. You're taking a bath. You're all lined up for everything you need. And you're sleeping. So, he still wants to learn how to drive and we haven't had a chance to do that, so when it's sunlight again, we'll or when somebody has the energy to. I wonder if Moses can teach him. Okay, her midlife crisis is over. Moses, can you teach him how to drive? Let's see. You have no interactions. Let's see if you can. Get up. Get up. Oh, yeah, he can. All right. Moses, you're going to teach him how to drive, because your needs are, well, you're really tired, but. Let's see if this will work. I mean, if a robot can't teach you how to drive, nobody can. <laughs> okay, yeah, sure. Oh, he's so tired. Okay, I normally don't, but I'm going to cheat up his needs a little bit. Oh, testing, cheat, testing, cheats, enabled, true, because it's my fault that he's so tired, so I'm just going to give him a little bit of energy. There. Just so he doesn't, like, totally collapse. He's sleeping. What are you doing? How's your job? Oh, you are so close. Let's scan for some more spirits. You are so close. OK, 
Okay, let's see how this is going. Oh, I forgot to... <laughs> oh, I need to go and recolor. I didn't do a very good job of that. His doors are black. That's sort of weird looking. Why would you have the doors be a different color? <laughs> Okay, you're doing good, doing good. You're doing well, you're doing well. There's the junkyard, there's our old house. Ugly house. <laughs> oh, you're doing okay. Not sure which level he's on. I think he might be just on level one or two, actually. Let's check on you. You are so close. Now, you know what? You you can go up there, but you are not going to sleep. I'm going to have you scan a bunch of times upstairs. Scan your room for ghosts. So you are level 7. Very good. You're getting there. It's Saturday, so you might have uh, some work to do later. Let's see. Uh, oh, except, oh yeah, you work today. Getting noticed around town is not the easiest thing to do, but Damon managed to get a foothold. Hmm. Damon will no longer be a nobody. He's a famed leecher. Grown-up wardrobe for Taryn Timon. Alright, let's go ahead and do that. I don't know what your needs are like. I always send you out tired and hungry, don't I? I'd like to get this done all in one sitting if possible, but I don't know. Big lemon stolen from blank. <laughs> We've stolen so many we don't even remember who it's from. Come on, you are so close. Alright, yeah, I knew that was too good to be true. Go ahead and go home. You guys can go take a nap and then we'll have you come back out. Let's follow him over. So, a grown-up wardrobe for Taryn Timmons. Oh, boy, this person wants everything. Well, oh, Taryn is rich. Maybe we should hook her up with our son. Are you Taryn? Yep. Uh, let's see. Friendly introduction. That's a nice house, but I don't know if I would consider you to be rich. And then we will do fashion offer makeover. Are you home in bed, hopefully? Or getting there anyway? You can take care of yourselves. You're at least at home. Oh man, look at his needs. <laughs> All from teaching a teenager how to drive. <laughs> oh, and he's unhappy about wasting natural resources because he was in a car. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. You can take care of yourself. Okay, did you do what I told you? No, you didn't. Fashion. Offer makeover. Are you a vampire? Looks like she's got the glowing eyes. That's another weirdly shaped house. There are so many trees in this neighborhood. Okay, seriously? Could you do what I asked you? Yeah, not to say you need a makeover, but you need a makeover. Okay, hopefully this won't take too long. 
Okay, new everyday wear, new makeup, shoes, sleepwear, formal hair, hair, hair color. Let's do um, hair color, hairstyle, and makeup first. Her eyebrows are so thin. Let's give her this crazy hairstyle. How about this one? Oh my, okay. <laughs> I think we have a winner. Eyebrows. Match your root color. Um, she wants a new hair color. Should we go with blonde? Uh, it actually looks better on her, I think. Gray? Let's go with blonde. And then makeup. You know I can't be nice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's interesting. Okay, we'll leave that one out. Okay, so we did makeup and hairstyle and hair color. Let's go over to clothing. Everyday wear, you definitely need something new. I guess I could put her all in modern stuff. Even though she's in the 20s, she, wanted, she wants to go like a few hundred years into the future. Any day. There we go. Let's see what we got for bottoms. Come on, game. Yeah, that doesn't look too bad. We'll give her new shoes for this outfit. I don't think those are really going to match, but we'll see. <clears throat> Okay, do they have invisible heels or I just can't see them in this view? It, uh, weird, are they invisible heels in real life? That's funny. Okay, so she's got new shoes, new everyday wear, makeup shoes. Okay, new sleepwear. You look very funny, lady. May I just say, okay, we'll put her in this modern nightgown, and then she's going to need two new formal so wear small. outfits. Okay, futuristic. I wish they would put these things in this order. <laughs> okay, so formal wear. Any day game. Let's see what she's already wearing. That is formal? I don't think so. This is much more suited for your new style. Uh, let's see with these, this dress. I think there are some like shoes that are sort of like that style could be totally hallucinating yes I guess I am unless I just missed it could have sworn there were some like lace up top shoes was I thinking about these Uh, those are pretty wild. They don't go even remotely with what you're wearing. Okay, that's modern looking. Okay, so that's formal. Oh, we need two formal wear. Ugh. And let's see, there are quite a few dresses. How about this one? I actually like that one. I think it's cute. <laughs> Alright, that's good. Okay, so two formal wear, 
New hair color we did. Okay, we need new swimwear. And then athletic wear. Okay, let's see what you're wearing. Swimwear. She must not have been in the game when the game neighborhood was generated because I don't think she would have been put in these different outfits. Okay, let's give you a modern bathing suit. Huh, that's not too bad. And let's add another one. Another modern bathing suit and athletic wear and then we will be done. I think the athletic wear for the Into the Future is sort of weird. Unless you pick something individual, but if you're looking at the outfits, and her booty's hanging out, um, so, so. the athletic wear I think is a little crazy. Nobody's gonna work out in that. <laughs> but hey, who am I to say? Alright, so we did everyday wear. We did makeup, shoes, sleepwear, formal wear, new hair color, swimwear, hairstyle, athletic wear, and done. We'll see her coming down the street, won't we? We should just redo everybody in the whole neighborhood. Okay, does she like... Oh, she's bored? Well, how dare you. Okay, are we going to take a picture? We're not asking her her sign. We're not going to impress her. Okay, did that not... Okay, what? Are you going to go take a nap? Let's see if she kicks you out. You can nap there if you want to, but if she kicks you out, you gotta go. Uh, his needs are still horrible. <laughs> Did you break it? Okay, trivial entertainment. Come upstairs and play a game for a few minutes. Play foosball. And then you can go to sleep. You might be too tired to even do it. Is she letting you sleep? Yeah, I guess she is. Alright. <laughs> if you want to take a nap on some lady's porch, that's fine. Everybody is super tired today. I'm wearing my Sims out. <laughs> well, I guess we've been going long enough. I'll go ahead and end this here. I hope that you enjoyed it and that you will uh, come back again. And I hope that you will like it, subscribe it. Subscribe and tell your friends about it. Have a great day. Bye.